That's David Patterson. He works in the library. Uh, do you want to share anything with you? Sure. Well, I'd just like to say, if you're thinking about joining AGS, Alpha Gamma Sigma, I hope you do. It's a great organization. The students are really friendly. Um, they have a lot of fun. And they do a lot of great stuff for the community. So for example, hi guys, welcome. There's gonna be a blood drive. I mean, what could be better than getting blood for the community? Um, and yet they have fun getting it. <laughs> and they, they do all sorts of great stuff for the, the college and the community. So if you're thinking about it, I know it costs a little money, but I think it's well worth it. And it looks great on a resume. <laughs> I mean, you shouldn't join for that, but it does look good when you're thinking of transferring to a college or applying for an internship or something. So I can't speak highly of it enough. And um, I guess that's all I wanted to say. Yeah. Thank you, David. Yeah, sure. What's up, Dave? Good to see you. Always good to see you. If you don't know Dave, you gotta go to the library and make him your best friend. He'll talk, tell you all the tricks and the trades <laughs> and the secrets because that should be your office. All right. All right? Go there and, and master that. How many people want to transfer? Raise your hand if you want to transfer. Great. The game is being played at UC Berkeley, UCLA, Chico State. <laughs> I went to Chico State, it's a magical little world, okay? <laughs> okay? You learn how to balance having fun and taking care of your business. But the game is being played the same way, they just might label the terms and your services a little differently. So get comfortable playing this game. Uh, I know a lot of people in here, uh, my name's Troy Stevenson, uh, I'm a counselor, so if you wanna talk about transferring, come see me or one of the other counselors. Um, we'll talk about what they're looking for. Okay, these schools are looking for a good fit. Why are you a good fit to represent you know, uh, UC Irvine, okay? Because they want you to come in, graduate, get that nice job, and then donate some money back, right? Uh, <laughs> one of the events that I'm running uh, through Emoja, Emoja means unity, everyone say unity. 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 That was weak, everyone say unity. 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 A little better. Uh, we're, so we're, having, we're sponsoring a basketball game. I coached college basketball for over 10 years, so I gotta stay involved, right? It's basketball season right now. Uh, so I gotta stay involved to a certain degree. Women play at 5.30, men at 7.30, here at home versus Solano this Friday. Come in, support your campus, some of your classmates. I'm gonna have a hospitality room, okay? So one of my friends used to play for the Warriors, okay? Uh, Justin uh, Holiday. So when I go to his games, there's a hospitality room where like Steph Curry's, you know, parents and daughters running around and all these other players. So the hospitality room has free food. You can come in, get a little snack, go back out, watch the game, come in, you know, get some more food. So this Friday, come through, say hi to me, uh, watch a little basketball. I think that's about it, right, Jeff? Yeah. yeah. A lot of fun. Questions? Here, here at College of Marin, just kind of across the street. Okay. Like where the gym is. Questions, comments, concerns? Thank you, friends. Thank Thanks, Joy. Yep. Thanks, Joy. Thanks, Dave. All right. Bye, Dave. Bye, Dave. Bye, Dave. Yeah. Really? <laughs> so, welcome, everybody. You're here because you got a little piece of paper in the mail and a little application to join ADS. So, what ADS is? It's the Honor Society on campus, and there's another one too, but they're not really active. Uh, we do a lot of community service together, a lot of events. For those of you who did previous semester with us, you guys know the kind of uh, events that we do. We're gonna touch on that so you know the requirements to be part of AGS. And one more information. Maybe we should just introduce ourselves. So I'm Bella, I'm the president of AGS. This is my second term. Uh, thank you for being here. And I'm Milan. I'm the fundraising coordinator. This is my second member as a uh, second semester as a board member, but will be my fourth semester in AGS. I'm the fundraising coordinator. <laughs> hey guys, I'm Isabella too. Um, I'm your social events coordinator, and this is my second term on the board. And I've had a few semesters being AGS. And I'm Joe. Um, I'm the vice president. It's just like, I don't remember how many times, but I've been on the board for like three semesters now or something. Yeah. OG. OG. <laughs> OG. Hey, guys. I'm Ashley. I'm the 
Uh, I'm Ferguson. I'm the web tech coordinator. This is my first semester on the board. Can I just say, like, why are you sitting here? Oh, yeah. I'm sitting here, so I'm filming all the meetings. So that way you can watch them online and you get half a point for watching the meeting online. So we have meetings every two weeks. You don't have to attend them. They are equivalent to one point or two. One point towards the end of the year. And if you can't make them, you go on YouTube, you watch the video, you write five or whatever key things that we talked about, you submit it to our email, and you get half a point. So even if you can't make it to the meetings, you can still get points. This is our meeting times. Sorry, the lights. Uh, these are all the meetings that we're going to have this semester. Like I said, you can either, either come to the Tuesday one uh, or Wednesday. We're going to have about eight meetings total this semester. This is on Facebook and Moodle. I'm going to explain how to get there so you can have that information or you can take a photo if you want. Alpha meaning excellence, gamma meaning knowledge, sigma meaning wisdom. Uh, and this is like something that I made up. I like to think about AGS as achieving academic su success while giving back to the community. Like I said, we do about eight hours together of community service. You're more than welcome to do a lot more if you want. That's amazing. Uh, but I think that's the center of our mission. So these are the requirements. Do you guys want to talk about it? Yeah. So I don't talk about it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so this is our membership requirements. Um, so at the end of the semester, or let me say this better. Throughout the semester, you're trying to um, get as many points as you can in each category. And there's um, serve, like community service points, AGS points, community involvement, college and college So it's four categories. And there's a minimum requirement of um, these points per category. And we'll have different events. Like we'll have, um, can't talk guys, um, <laughs> community the, service the events. The point being is that we're going to provide these events for you to yeah. make them minimum. But also you can go on your own and still attain these points if you're not able to make it with us. So we're going to give you several options and things that you can do outside of this group. But you always have the chance and the ability to complete each section. Uh, so it's really doable. D these are like, yeah, don't let it scare you off. And once you start coming to meetings, you'll see that we'll um, give you events that will like tell you events that are coming up or things that are happening around the area that you can do and get the points for, not necessarily just with us. Um, so it's totally doable, so don't let it scare you off. Yeah, and the whole thing is to build a sense of community. Like we want to be friends with you. Like we're all in this thing you. together. And it's not just that you can get the requirement, but also get to know other students on campus. Uh, this is just talking about the YouTube situation. Like if you miss the meeting, you can just watch the YouTube channel and then email it to us. And this is really important. If you don't meet the requirements, it's not gonna say member of Alpha Gamma Sigma on your transcript at the end. So like at the, I think it's, So at the end of the semester, you're going to report to us all the points that you did. You're going to put all the requirements and whatever you did. And then we're going to submit that, submit those points to our advisors. And they're going to put your name under the list. And you're going to have your name under the members, like under the unemployed. Is this slide online? Uh, no. Oh, it's going to be on the YouTube channel. You can watch this again. Like you're gonna hear me talk everything else. I'm just thinking the points are important, so we should yeah. like know about so it. Yeah, so all the points, I, I'm gonna show you the sheet that we have a guideline. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll talk about it in a second. And it. It's all online, it's on Facebook and Moodle, so everyone has access to it, even if they don't have Facebook. This is what this uh, point sheet looks like. You're gonna say, today I went to the bake sale for two hours and I get four points. For community service, I did eight hours with Marin General. And then you put 16 points, and this is a total. Then you submit this to us, and then we'll be like, great job, like, you did great. And you have to um, supply proof, so make sure that if you don't do it with us, you have proof of it, because we are going to check, and if 
we keep our proof as well. And if, it, if you said you did it, but we don't have proof, we can't give you the points for it. Yeah. And this is just examples of what you can do for each category. If you have a cool idea that you want to do and you want to share with us that we can do it together, that's great. Or if you want to do something with your family or friends, you can also do that. Just take a picture like, hey, I went to the farmer's market for this uh, requirement right here, and I was there. I bought some veggies to support the local community. And then you say, right here, like, attend a farmer's market on this day, and then you just show a picture that you were there. Or just some sort of proof. Like, we believe you. We just want to know that you actually uh, so yeah, this is on Moodle and Facebook. I have a question about community service. So if I go and I want to clean up the beach, do I need a member to supervise? Yeah, like we were talking about last semester, if you're trying to clean up a beach by yourself, you can't really prove that. I mean, you can go anywhere. I think you, for a cleanup or like a park cleanup we'll too. Like, do a beach cleanup this semester because it is spring. Yeah, so I think for that one, I think you just need someone to make you accountable for that, because anyone can just go anytime, and I don't know, just kind of tricky. Yeah, you could you could take a photo and you say you cleaned up, but you were really there just to tan. So we should ask, <laughs> should, should we ask first if, if I'm planning to do something, should I ask her yeah. if you have a category, so I know what Yeah, we're probably yeah. going to do a beach cleanup or a park cleanup. Yeah, that was spring, so yeah. Yeah, so yeah we're nice trying style. to clean up our community service. Okay. So it's fine. Yeah, <laughs> don't worry. But that's a good thing. And we also give you guys, we let you know ahead of time, so because we know like a lot of you work and stuff, and so if you want to get the day off, we give you plenty of time yeah. for that. I, I already have planned a bunch of events that you guys can put on your calendar. Uh, if some of them are like a month and a half in advance. So. Also, um, can you go back to that? <laughs> Uh, just because it says it on there doesn't mean it's limited to that. So if you think you have something that's worth less points, you can ask one of the members, and we can try to figure it out for you. Yeah. Can you go? Yeah. Sorry, just in the room, Philip. Uh, I just had a question about the sign-in sheet. Um, Is this coming around? Oh, uh, yeah, it's coming around. It's the laptop. It's on my laptop. Oh, it's a lot. Oh, sorry. I thought someone had it. Okay, thank you. I got you. So talking about the application, you have to attach your transcript. Again, we're, um, how do I say this? <coughs> Green. Huh? The transcript? The, the proof. purpose of the transcript is because you have, you're all here because you're all getting above a 3.0. And we're, what else am I going to say that I don't remember? I'll come back to it. We're very proud of you, but we need to make sure that you <laughs> Actually, it's about academic excellence, excellence. so yeah. we're here to celebrate you guys, but also you have to show proof that you're the 3.0 and above students. Um, I, is, is it possible to like email you the our academic transcript? You should yeah. have it. Yeah, just will make we, sure you put your name, your full name. Will we email your the ADS? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and it's twenty seven dollars. The reason why it has a cost to it is because we send that money to the organization so we can keep the organization going. Uh, you have to pay every semester. Unfortunately, you can't just buy it, pay for it one time. Uh, the second page is just to uh, give consent to us to take photos of you. We have a Facebook page, and it's a private group. Only you guys are going to be part of it. Uh, so don't think like your people are checking out your photos online. <coughs> Also, we put some photos on Moodle, and only people who enroll in AGS can see it. So it's just for us. That's why you would be signing this. So this is what our Facebook page looks like. You look up AGS College of Marin, and this shows up. You can ask to join, and I'll accept your request. Or I can just add you guys here after the meeting. We keep all of our events there, all of the information. So it's really nice to have that there. Uh, and this is how you go to Moodle, like the page on Moodle. You go to Dashboard, you scroll down, and it says Alpha Gamma Sigma Honor Society. You click there. You have to click Enroll Me, and then this cool page shows up. And then your enrollment reports you have in Moodle in case no one uses Facebook. You don't have Facebook, there's another option for you. Yeah, so on Moodle and Facebook, I did a Google so 
you guys can just click on that link and all of our events, all of our meetings are there. So you can always keep yourself up to date. Uh, these are just pictures of us volunteering. This was a beach cleanup like two semesters ago. And we partner up with Blue Star Moms. I don't know if you guys know what that program does, but essentially they do care packages for the troops. I think we did about 25 or 30 of them with just like basic care needs, like food, toothbrush, toothpaste, deodorant, stuff like that. Uh, so this is our first event that we're going to do together, or like one of the community service events. It's on our Google Calendar, and it's not yet on Facebook, but it's going to be from 9 to 1. 